we interrupt your regularly broadcast television schedule to bring you an important update. <clears throat> it appears that there is a rising situation in the world. It's being called a global epidemic. We are just now receiving word that it, the epidemic has reached the countries of China, Guam, Puerto Rico, and now Alaska. Early reports from the field are indicating a growing fear of privacy violation and a heightened sense of fear. Without further ado, we go we go live, 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 where Tyson Lochner will explain the situation. Camera off. Are we off the air? Thank God, I need to get out of this suit. I don't think we should start the video until he gets here. He's not going to be happy, Warren. Oh, don't worry. He won't be too mad. He'd just be a little angry. He yell at you. I blame on British guy. He is going to be pissed. He, he, I... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Here he comes. Be quiet, one. Be quiet. Why is the red light on the camera turned on right now? I told you you don't start the video until I tell you to start it. How long have you guys been recording while I have been prepping for this video? You idiots! You idiot immigrants! I tell you not to start the video until I sit down. Is that not in your script? Is that in your script? Well, well, sir, it was not my idea. I told this Mexican guy, do, 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 Stressful time in my life right now and I'm going through it and I don't need you two immigrants messing up my YouTube videos So you two little children get out of the room. Just leave. Just take a vacation forever. Go <sighs> One two three Hello there today. I have some information for you I have been getting some reports of a rising situation in today's society. It is a problem. It is a condition. And it is your conditional problem to deal with. So I'm going to tell you what it is. We are under attack. The whole world is under attack by the Great Mole Rat. Just like it says up there on the title. What is a Great Mole Rat? I have some pictures that I'm going to show you. And this is what a Great Mole Rat is. Yes, best way to put that. Tight gonna grab some afternoon delight. Okay, I'm a little frustrated that those guys started my video without me. So for the remainder of this video, I'm gonna be wearing a red shirt because I am pissed, okay? Red symbolizes angry T-Lock, and T-Lock is pretty angry right now, can't you tell? Angry face. Anyways, we have lots to talk about today, so I'm going to get to talking about what we have to talk about because that's why you are listening. Maybe. Actually, I don't know why you're listening. Why would anyone want to listen to me? Yep, without further ado, I give you me and Red. There's a very pressing matter that needs to be discussed. According to my extensive research, it's a phobia. And I have touched on this subject lightly with both hands um, back in my sexy naked girl POV video. This phobia is called Zeminophobia. It's the fear of the great mole rat. I've been so curious about this issue that I decided to do some extensive research. Extensive research on the fear of the great mole rat. If you try and figure out what this fear is by googling it or anything else, any other internet search provider, you will not find it. I spent 500 days looking this up. Okay, maybe not that many days, but it wasn't even close to that. See, the thing is that I found xenophobia, however you say it. I'll put that word up on the screen right now. Yep, there it is. My question was, what is the great mole rat? So when I got to looking at this issue a little more in depth, I discovered that it is very in depth. This is the only definition of the fear of the great mole rat that I could find. It says, Zemin, Zemin, it says that Z phobia word. Fear of the great mole rat. Offers? I'm not exactly sure what this word is. Uh, they believe that the great mole rat is tapping into their phone lines. And more. Question mark. I got linked over to this blog. What is the great mole rat? The great mole rat is a very large naked mole rat with purple wings and very large teeth on which it impaled our college director. Cat Cat Maple says, The great mole rat ate my pink fluffy thong and attacked my Mexican fighting cock. 
Because this is so disturbing, I am out to kill the great mole rats of the world. If you would like to help in my conquest, please send any information on the termination of great mole rats to www.killthegreatmolerats.org. Brit Lee Shaw left a post on this blog. She says, The Great Mole Rat, period. I fear he's coming in the night for me, exclamation points. If only I knew what he was, dot dot dot. Someone help me, more explanation points. Like any other problem in this world, there are people that can help. There are people that can help. Feelings of dread, overwhelming thoughts, rapid heartbeat, tunnel vision, worse. And these are all question marks after all one of these word phrases. We have never met a case of the fear of the great mole rat that could not be overcome. If you are ready to conquer the fear for once and for all, CTRN promises you. Get started now. There are two ways of helping you get over the fear of the great mole rat. This is empty, I'm gonna set it down. You can either work through our home study program on your own, or you can work one-on-one -on -one with a specialist. All you have to do is pay them a lot of money, and you will stop worrying about that really, really big 10-foot mole rat with the big dick eating your phone lines. You can pay to get rid of that fear. That is the best thing since Cheerios. After they go through that big spiel, here's what they say next. We do not actually treat, nor do we cure. You're the only one with the influence to change your perceptions. We simply walk you through the process and enable you to do so. In that case, I think that they're saying, uh, you pay us some money and we're going to play a little mind game with you to make you think that we are helping you get over the fear of the great mole rat because it is terrifying. So, you got this fear about the great mole rat tapping into your phone lines. This is extremely logical for several reasons. One, the great mole rat does not exist. Two, if it did exist, it'd be an animal. And three, how the hell is the great mole rat supposed to tap into your phone line if it doesn't exist and if it's an animal if it did exist? Hey man, what happens if we this push this little this rat button over stupidity. here? Do How not can do that. Don't push, don't push that button. What is don't. going on? Oh shit. Oh shit. What is going on? He is going to be pissed. Oh shit. I've got a sudden urge to put down my coffee. better have a goddamn good excuse for what you just did to the camera. Sir, I told him not to push the red button. Sir, can I push the green button? No, you cannot push the green button. You are messing up my video. If you touch that green button, I told you. If you want more information about the great mole rat, we may have some someday in the really far away future. We can go hunt great mole rats. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe. Uh, shoot. Yeah. www.youtube.com slash user slash tlock15. Please subscribe. Coffee's pretty good. Coffee is freaking awesome. This is the point of the video where I stand in front of the camera with a blank look on my face trying to remember if there's anything else that I need to say to the camera before I cover it up with my hand. Nothing I can think of right now.